Hi there, Taurus. I'm here to get you some tarot messages for today. Let's look into the energies of your person. See what's going on with your person. What do these cards have to say today? We have King of Pentacle. Knight of Cup. Empress. King of Cups. Strength. Three of Wands. Five of Cups. Hermit energy. All right, so a couple of kings here. King of Pentacles, King of Cups, uh, along with the Knight of Cups. So I feel like your person has grown emotionally here, um, and it's because of you. It's because of your energy, because of your understanding energy, because of your um, nurturing energy. I feel like you've given your person the space they needed to figure their shit out. Uh, to put it bluntly, that's just what I'm getting here. Like, you gave your person room to figure out what's going on. Like, where are they going? What's important to them? Um, and it's because of you. I feel like you... You, um, I'm getting like you kind of withdrew your energy and gave your person the space to figure it out, figure out where they're going, what's important to them, what they're capable of, um, and the action they're going to take, um, stepping into the future here because things are about to change here. I feel like you, I'm looking at these keys here on this hermit. Number nine energy is like nine. We're almost there. We're almost at a, a turning point. We're almost um, ready to open new doorways. Like you hold the key to your person's heart um, and vice versa. Uh, they hold the key to your heart to open new doorways. New, you like door a doorway to the future is what I'm getting here. And it's going to be... Um, it's going to be a good experience. You know, the two of you may have been like through a lot of ups and downs, a lot of challenges. Uh, maybe at one point you didn't know whether you were coming or going or are we, you know, like what is up with this relationship? Uh, there might have been like a miscommunication or maybe uh, the timing was always off. Maybe like, you know, when when you were ready, your person wasn't. And when your person was ready, you weren't ready. And it's like things are going to pan out. And I feel like you gave your person the space they needed to figure this out, to prioritize, um, grow emotionally, uh, and figure their shit out is what I'm getting here. Strength. Yeah, king of pentacles strength. I feel like your person is confident in the way forward now and it's because of you it's because you you've taught them a lot about themselves even just by being you you didn't have to say anything or do anything just by having you um in in their life experience has taught them how to it's given them emotional growth is what I'm getting here. Death energy. Yeah, it's changed their whole perspective about life, about emotions, about what's important. Um, it's you. It's been you all along. Uh, Ten of Cups. Yeah, you make your person very happy. And, it, you know, it took them a separate, it took a separation for them to realize um, the, the emotional... Um, satisfaction they get from just your essence. The essence of you is transforming. It makes them feel healed. It makes them feel whole. It makes them feel secure, capable, strong. We got the strength card here. We've got um, justice here. There's something about um, the ability to turn things around here, move into the future, release, um, release the past, uh, prioritize. Uh, we got the Empress again. It's like, yeah, you're, you're, you're 
all your person wants and needs. Your person definitely sees a future with you here. They think about it. They know that your energy brings them joy. Your energy, you are the world to your person here. We have Gaia on this particular um deck here it's like the world uh wheel of fortune here fortune's wheel it's like yes there's something about your connection that has helped your person see the way forward you're you know five of cups can be a turning point and wheel of fortune you know things are turning turning the tide for the better here is what i'm getting high priestess your person is connecting more to uh, their softer side, their feminine side, their intuitive side, uh, and everything is about to change here. Three of Pentacles. Yeah, this connection is strong. You are meant to be together, work together, um, share share each other's thoughts, ideas, talents. Um, you know, there's the owl here. I'm looking at these owls, these three owls. Owls for me represent wisdom, knowledge, seeing things. You know, owls can be nocturnal. They see in the dark. They can see. They have precision. Like there's something. Your person is seeing a whole new side of themselves. Maybe they're finding their um, soul mission, their, um, their, their wisdom, their intuitive wisdom their nurturing side their feminine side here their spiritual side wow yeah moon energy moon is um moon can be uh emotional moon can be very e internal energy uh this is what spirit most wants us to know hermit moon i feel like they they can now see things they never saw before Maybe they're learning to be uh, intuitive. Maybe they're watching tarot readings now. Or maybe they're interested in their softer side. Uh, let's look at the bottoms of these decks because I'm, I'm looking here and we got the King of Sword. But this King of Sword is called the Poet, you know, and, and the King of Swords can be very... Um, matter of fact like you know sometimes king of swords can be like the you know if they can't see it touch it taste it it doesn't exist but this particular king of swords he's he's found his softer side the poet you know he can you are like your person's muse uh and they see this new opportunity to build a future with you quite lovely energy You've taught your person a lot. You've put your person in touch with their feminine side, regardless of their gender. Um, they they see, they have like a new, a newfound perspective. They've become, they've awakened because of you is what I'm getting. Wow. All right. Okay. So I'm going to pull um eternal light oracle message those two jumped off and i'm feeling like that one wants to be read too okay closing words of wisdom from the eternal light message we have self-love and compassion have compassion for yourself forgive yourself and be kind nothing and nobody is perfect when judged from a human perspective life and all its mystery unanswered questions and seeming imperfection is perfect see this from a higher perspective and feel it through the quiet of the heart life is a continuous learning experience we have the wheel of life we are on this earth for a short while we have no real idea why we're here where we came from or where we're going Perhaps we never come nor go, but change form from spirit into matter and matter into spirit as the wheel of life turns. We have reaching out. Share your concerns, insecurities, and fears with those you love and trust. Nothing is so dark that it cannot be talked about. Be courageous and reach out. You may discover that others have had similar feelings and experiences. You may also realize that you are very much valued and loved. Peace be with you. Bye now.